Hello friends, welcome to my channel once again. In today's video, we will learn how to upgrade to Windows 11 on an unsupported device without using a bootable media. So this is uh, Windows 10 on this PC and I will be upgrading it to Windows 11 using an ISO file which we will download from Microsoft website and uh, we will use a trick with the help of which we will be able to bypass the system requirement check and we will not get the error message we usually get on unsupported devices where it says uh, this PC does not meet Windows 11 system requirements. So let's first download the ISO file from Microsoft website. Open up a browser and simply search for Windows 11 ISO. We'll click on the first link and we'll just scroll and we'll go to the option where it says download Windows 11 disk image that is ISO click on select download and select Windows 11 and then click on download then it will ask you to choose your language so you can select English United States or if you want any other language you can select that and click confirm let's give it some time and then our download will be ready simply click on 64-bit download because I'm going to install it on a 64-bit device so click download and as soon as you click download you will see a file will start downloading so I will skip this part and once the download completes, we will make some changes in the downloaded file. So let's just minimize it. So this is our download file. That is Windows 11 23H2 English. Right click on it. And you will see an option that would be mount. You can click on that, but if you don't see that option, that happens because of default program which is selected to open this file is ISO software which I have. But we can click on open with and choose the option Windows Explorer. So if you see mount, you can click on mount or right click and click on open with and select Windows Explorer as soon as you do that you will get the option to click open just simply click open and it will mount your ISO file if you click this PC you will see your mounted file here okay, just double click it and you will see the files which are available in that ISO file we will copy them all so select them all right click and then click on copy and just create a new folder anywhere I'll create a new folder on the desktop or I'll just create a new folder uh, here you can create it anywhere you want uh, to make it simple you can create it on desktop I'll name it Windows 11 setup and just open it and paste those files which which we have copied from that mounted ISO
so we have copied our files and now we will go to the sources folder and in sources folder look for a file that is app razor res dot dll and right click on it then click on open with click on show apps and select notepad and then click ok so this file will open up in notepad we will have to select everything in notepad so press ctrl and a so it will select everything and then press delete on the keyboard to delete everything then simply click on file and then click save and then close this notepad so we have deleted the data of this file and now we will go back this is the actual trick which will bypass the system requirement check while upgrading to windows 11 now we are ready to run the setup we will double click on setup and simply click on yes and it will initiate windows 11 upgrade now on this screen click on change how setup download downloads updates because we are not going to download the updates right at this moment or while upgrading to windows 11 we will do it later select the second option not right now and click next accept the license and then let it run you just need to follow the on-screen instructions and we will be able to successfully upgrade to windows 11 here we can click on install so the installation will take time you can skip this part if you want okay so we have windows 11 installed on our computer successfully so actually what i did i have installed this uh, windows 11 i mean i have upgraded from windows 10 to windows 11 on a virtual machine uh, earlier it was giving me an error message uh, that this pc cannot be upgraded to windows 10 because uh, it is an outdated pc so basically what we did we have skipped the uh, system requirement check and upgraded to a new window that is windows 11 so it is the easiest method of upgrading to windows 11 from windows 10 without using a bootable usb drive now we can uh, go to 
settings and we can try running those updates which we have skipped initially so it will download and uh, install those update without any problem i'll click on update and we will check for update and it will download and install all the updates without any problem So same way you can download these updates and it is an automated process once the download will be completed, uh, they, uh, Windows will install those updates and then it will ask you to restart the computer. So just go ahead and restart the computer once the installation of updates are done. So it shows we are up to date and all the updates got successfully uh, downloaded and installed we can close this now so i hope this video was helpful and if you like this video please click the like button and subscribe to my channel thank you once again you have a great day